what's up everyone and welcome back to my channel so I'm gonna be doing a uh, Gabriel Henrique uh, reaction hold on real quick it's uh, I have a humidifier on so the smoke that you're seeing is coming from that so all right that's off so uh, I'm gonna be doing a Gabriel Henrique reaction uh, to him singing oh holy night um, easy peasy loving the, the the stuff that you're sending me from him uh, glad to jump into it. So let's go. I love that this is a, a more gospel-y feel. You can feel it, it's just starting to, to pump up a little bit, but it's definitely gospel-rooted. Um, uh, he could use a little bit of uh, extra pronunciation, or sorry, enunciation on some of these words. Uh, again, not his first language, giving him a lot of uh, leeway there. Just saying, I don't really know what he's saying at this point, but it sounds great. <laughs> There we go. Says, for the I feel like he's doing just what he needs to do right now. It's not too much. It's not too early. He's taking his time. Let, let him do his thing. He'll do his thing while I drink my thing. A little tequila, freshly squeezed OJ, and some black cherry. Squeeze a lamb. The power on that is just incredible. I'm going back. Oh yeah. Come on. 
say I'm pointing out to the end of the field. He didn't do it this time. Oh. <laughs> I forgot. He gives it 100% of the time. I thought for a second he wasn't going to do the classic Gabriel Henrique Smolder look. The. But he did it. Oh. Uh, that last Smolder was for my homie Brittany Chupe. Uh, just uh, thought I'd throw that out there. So, um. Couple thoughts. Fantastic cover. Um, I loved it. I liked that it wasn't traditional necessarily. It had a gospel feel. Towards the end, um, you know, I, and obviously, I hope you guys know this, but I hope you know that that wasn't a final product raw vocal uh, track. It, it's processed, and that's okay. Most things are nowadays. That's okay. But guess what? You still have to sing like Gabriel to be able to sing like Gabriel to be able to get that sound. Um, but they did add a little bit too much. Um, at moments I couldn't tell if it was a delay or reverb. I, I want to say it was reverb, but it felt more like it had a delay to it. Um, that's why I'm saying delay, whatever. It was over processed a bit. Um, and I think they could have relied on his raw, for the most, most part, most of his raw, audio and some of the texture that'll come along with that but i think in the end it, it got like 15 percent a little bit too much pro or too processed um that being said it was still incredible and uh and i'm you know it's when he does those whistle notes too right i i knew the first time i heard him do that that any time i would hear him do that again that it would it would always feel like the first time and it does it's because it's it's so hard to do and um anyways I'm, I'm just impressed every time every single time so i don't have anything else to say like subscribe you know share my content if you like give me some recommendations whatever you can do to help support me in building this channel i'd greatly appreciate take care